Hey guys, this is Joe with that hashtag news feed filling in for Jessica this week is Daniel and we finally have the reveal of who the villain is going to be on Titans now after years of false starts fans of DC Comics Teen Titans finally have a reason to rejoice because the brand new television show Titans will make its live action debut in early 2018 the long awaited adaptation of the popular property is currently gearing up to shoot and there are a lot of reasons to get excited. Earlier in the summer, we were the first to reveal the main characters which, except for Beast Boy, have all been cast. Nightwing will be played by Brenton Thwaites, Tegan Croft is Raven, and Starfire is Anna Diop. And our report of Alan Richson being in the running to play Hawk has come to fruition and Deadline recently confirmed that he was locked for the role. And Mika Kelly also got cast as Dove, but now that the main cast has begun to come into focus, it's time to turn our attention to the villain. It's clear that the Titans will have no shortage of iconic heroes populating their show and now we have zeroed in on one of the baddies that the Titans will face off against. A recent casting call reveals two characters who will appear in the first episode, and one of them is the villain, The Acolyte. The Acolyte is a confident African-American male in his 40s. He's after Rachel and her powers, and he's trying to kidnap her after he murders her mother. The second character is Angela, Rachel's adoptive mom. She's also in her 40s, and she gets killed in an attempt to kidnap Rachel, aka Raven. Now, The Acolyte is a little used character from the comics who made his first appearance in Young Justice in 1999. In the comics, the villain's devilish appearance, complete with blue skin and horns, is nothing more than an elaborate ruse. He's nothing more than a crafty human, falsely claiming to be an immortal metahuman, while his true identity is unknown. It seems that the villain's origin and abilities will possibly be altered for his live-action debut and could potentially serve as a catalyst for much of the first season's action. The casting notice also gives us an idea of what direction they are taking the character Rachel. In the comics, Rachel Roth is the daughter of a human mother and a powerful demon named Trigon. The description specifies that it's her adoptive mother who was killed at the hands of the Acolyte. Now, presumably, this will be the inciting incident that not only leads her to the Titans, but is also the first piece of her learning her true power and heritage. While the show doesn't yet have a firm release date, you can expect to see it in early 2018 as a centerpiece to DC's exclusive streaming service. You guys excited to see Acolyte as the villain? I mean, do you think we'll see Trigon show up? Oh yeah, definitely. I hope so in the first season. I mean, I, I'm really excited about this show. We got all the casting laid out. For the most part, we know who the Titans are gonna be, but now we just gotta wait to see who they're gonna cast as Acolyte oh. and Trigon. Well, I'm down to see it and hopefully it's going to be amazing. That's gonna do it for us. Thanks for watching and hit that subscribe button to stay up to date with everything trending in geek pop culture.